for those who wander. Interior Law Office of Henry Cawthorn, Day. Reception Area. The Law Office of Henry Cawthorn, a brick colonial-style building across from the county courthouse. Ben enters. Estelle, Cawthorn's secretary, 24, looks up from her desk. Can I help you? I called and told a lady I was going to drop off my resume. Your what? Resume. I called and spoke. Yeah, I remember. Mr. Cawthorn ain't here. Will you give this to him when he comes in? Ben pulls the resume from his briefcase and hands it to Estelle. Despite Estelle's lie, Henry H. Cawthorn, 66, enters from his private office. Estelle hands the resume to Henry. He asked me to give this to you. And you are? Ben Adams. I'm looking for a job. Oh, come on back. Cawthorn's private office. Cawthorn enters, followed by Ben. Cawthorn takes a seat at his desk and pours over Ben's resume. Benjamin D. Adams. William and Mary School of Law. Moot Court. Law Review. Order of the Quaff. Henry looks over his glasses. You could work in a city law firm. What the hell you doing here? I want to serve the community where I grew up. Now I remember why your name sounds familiar. You're the goddamn agitator trying to integrate our schools. That's not correct. What do you call trying to enroll a Negro in the white school? Who hired you? The NAACP? The boy's father hired me. You listen to me, boy. If I hear another word about you messing with this county, I will have you arrested and your law license suspended. You'll never practice in this state. Cawthorn rips up the resume. Now get the hell out of here. Ben rises and walks to the door. One more thing, boy. Ben turns around. Your mama and daddy is still alive? My father passed last year. Be grateful he died before you disgraced him. Stung, Ben exits.